Chris, thank you. With cold weather in the forecast for a while, people who help the homeless are doing whatever they can to help keep them warm. But for one Lexington organization, this early blast of winter weather has given them some big challenges. WKYT's Garrett Weimer explains in our top story at 11. There's things that you laugh, man. You have. Uh... You're freezing death out there. Mike Wilson knows what it's like to be homeless during the winter. You just have to dress good, man. You can't be out here without some good clothes and stuff on. I got four layers on right now of hoodies and stuff, plus a big coat and stuff. And uh, other than that, man, the gloves. If you don't, man, you're going to get cold. During the day, Wilson relies on the Catholic Action Center as a place he can keep warm. And he says at night he stays at the ministry's community inn. That difference of having a place to go where there's heat, it can be the difference for some between life and death. The Catholic Action Center says normally they're a little more prepared for the winter, but this year the cold has come just so early. But this didn't give us time to get ready. This is just kind of coming in with a blast. Now they're looking for donations to help those like Wilson stay warm. Because he says you can't survive sleeping on the streets when the temperatures turn cold. His message to folks at home don't forget him and the other homeless this winter. It's really important to help our homeless people, and I wish you people would really reach out and help people the best y'all can. It means a whole lot to me, and God bless them all. In Lexington, Garrett Weimer, WKYT. Well said. Staff at God's Net are asking for donations of clothes, blankets, socks, hats, and gloves. You can donate at their location. They're at East 7th Street. That's tomorrow morning beginning at 930.